dogs are basically uh, uh, the kind of dogs that are versatile enough to go into uh, weight pulling or hunting or family pets. We try to get them socialized early. We make sure that they're wormed and have their shots. Now, the main uh, strain that we uh, work with uh, is the uh, Carver blood, mainly Ironhead, Pistol, and Miss Spike. These are the dogs that have been very successful for me over the years. I've been into these dogs from about 1965, 1966, and I've seen a lot of bloodlines come and go. These have been the most successful uh, for me, uh, the Ironhead, Pistol, Miss Spike dogs. Uh, also, we don't want to write off dogs like Black Widow, uh, also a Carver bred dog, which is the foundation for all of the Bolio dogs. So as I take you around, I'll uh, kind of explain some of the bloodlines and uh, uh, some of the litters that I have, and uh, hopefully... This is uh, Champion Opie. Uh, Opie. and he loves females. He's, he's just a big playboy. Uh, seven years old, as you can see, he's still like a puppy. Uh, but however, don't be misled by that uh, because uh, he is a merciless destroyer uh, who has but one intent, and that's the total and utter destruction of his opponent. So uh, Opie is a three-time winner. Uh, uh, he is Nigarino on the uh, bottom, double Nigarino uh, on the top. Opie, here's a uh, double Nigarino on the bottom and on the top. He's uh, uh, Pistol Miss Spike through Petronelli Fox and Boomerang. And uh, his extreme top side uh, is uh, uh, the Booger Dog from Andre Giroux. Uh, this is his daughter here, uh, Kali. Kali is now about seven months old, uh, perhaps eight, uh, but she is uh, she's fight crazy. Uh, from the time she was small, that was her thing. But as you can see, she's a gorgeous dog, uh, very well made, uh, kind of a tall. I, I, I prefer to have uh, my dogs with a little leg on them. They, they pull weight a lot better. Uh, when, when they've got that uh, extra leg on them, but a uh, beautiful rear end on her. She's, uh, uh, she's developing quite well. We're happy with her. Now this guy over here, this is her brother, Kali's brother, uh, also out of OP. Uh, they're little mates. I had to separate them at uh, 11 weeks old. They were just uh, totally uh, butchering each other. Uh, so now uh, they unfortunately have to be out on the chain instead of being able to play with each other i have to be very careful about uh, getting them too close to each other because it is pure war all right we're going to be looking around at some of the other dogs in just a little bit so once again here's uh kali and uh now over by kali uh this little bitch here uh is a Pure Patrick bitch. She is uh, sired by Patrick Hanson off of uh, Patrick and Cooper's Bermuda. Uh, I, I, I believe I have some earlier footage uh, on her that I'll share with you, but she's being bred now to a dog called uh, Sweet Peas Whitaker from Marcia Die Kennels, a handsome uh, bred, uh, homer bred dog. Uh, Pure Patrick. Uh, she uh, she has a litter of pups there that we're we're basically looking at, and uh, we're trying to find out uh, how they're going to turn out. So far, they've been acting real good. Okay, once again, there is uh, old Mr. Blister, uh, who is the uh, brother to Kali. Both of those young dogs would be uh, twelve hundred apiece. Now these pups that you see here. <laughs> are uh, almost pure boomerang, heavy, heavy, heavy bred for boomerang off of my M80 dog who carries boomerang 80 times, uh, bred to a uh, Hollingsworth uh, 
uh, Bull's daughter, the pure Patrick, Hugh Patrick, and Boomerang. Incidentally, uh, Kali and Blister are out of the uh, almost pure Boomerang mix, so uh, it's uh, heavy uh, covers, iron head, pistol, mist spike combination. Now these pups are acting real good. I, I'm, I'm very pleased with them, and uh, I, I think they're going to make uh, some better than average bulldogs. So uh, there will be, I think, two for sale out of this litter. That should be 700. I, I'll have pedigrees in there for you. This crazy dog is looking up here at me. This is the sister to Lady Handsome. Her name is Shania, after the country singer Shania Twain. Now she has pups here. These pups, uh, she is herself is pure Patrick. Uh, these pups are 50% Patrick, 50% Grand uh, Champion Boomerang. Very pleased with them. And uh, there are some unusual colors there. Now, most of the time, this will equate into like deep red. Now, there's a couple that are almost black. Very, very dark. And uh, very black mask on them, you see? So now, they're probably going to be deep red with uh, black masks on them. So, uh, but, but very impressive litter. Now, you might notice the black uh, pad down there. Now, that's actually a heating pad, which keeps the pups, even though it's a little chilly today. As you can see, the pups uh, show no discomfort. Uh, that pad is actually quite warm. Uh, and as long as you've got paper in there to give them a little traction, uh, they're, they're, they're uh, just fine. So basically, uh, this litter here will be ready uh, probably the uh, middle of January, and uh, uh, they will be 700 apiece. That's uh, Patrick Boomerang. The daddy is a dog uh, we have called Curly. And uh, Curly is a uh, tested and proven dog uh, um, and, and, a, and a very outstanding specimen. You'll see him on later footage. That's my girl. This is the heathen here. These are cut fired by Champion Sam out of a daughter of Champion Opie. Absolutely beautiful pup. Uh, just, uh, just crazy, actually. They are just totally insane. There's one male here uh, that is for sale. Uh, one black male. The the uh, the two red ones are females. That little red fellow there, a buckskin actually. Uh, he's a, he's a male. But uh, either one of the two uh, black males uh, would be available. There's uh, one that seems to have a bit more white on him than the other. Uh, the one with the left white seems to be the more aggressive of the two. But uh, this is uh, uh, out of a champion, there's a of a champion. Uh, the background would be China uh, on her bottom side, Brad to Opie, who's making a little boomerang. And uh, then on the uh, side of Sam, he's 50% boomerang and 50% uh, bully son Eli Jr. Ought to have some heavy mild on and be some just powerful, powerful specimens. So they're starting to get a little large right now. Uh, and they're starting to get a bit aggressive, so they're going to have to be separated before too long. And in there, you can see the heating unit again, uh, which keeps them nice and warm. When the weather changes, I move from that water into uh, a heated water bucket. Now, over here, here's another group of heating, you see, and uh, these guys are... Side by Opie, 
Uh, there are two in here that are out of M80. Uh, that Brenda one is an outstanding male. Uh, this, this black one here that's trying to, to come out is also an outstanding uh, specimen. My favorite uh, is that one way back there. Uh, he's a little bit shy. He acts shy. Uh, and I made the mistake of giving him the run of the house, and uh, he tore up not only my papers, but he just made it wreak havoc in, in, my, in, my, in my house. So uh, I barred him out of the house unless somebody's supervising him. But as you can see, the skirmishes are getting a little heated, and uh, you have to be very, very careful because after a while, uh, they, 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 they can get pretty pretty intense, but uh, as you can see, a gorgeous litter, uh, and the two pups, the brindle male, right there, okay, outstanding dog, uh, that little female, you'll see her uh, on some footage I took earlier, her, her little nose is kind of bruised right now, but uh, she's hot as fire. And uh, uh, seems to want to uh, be very aggressive. All right, so here we've got Opie to a ditch. Uh, we, we call Peaches. She's uh, almost to a boomerang. And then we have M80 uh, also to a pure boomerang ditch. Well, you have... Well, you just had her. I wish you would just her. Yeah. Now, these guys here are about five months old, and uh, I'm very surprised that they're getting along so well. Uh, they are stunningly beautiful pups, uh, and uh, their mother is Bonita, uh, the Patrick bitch. Remember, uh, I showed you footage of her, her daughter, rather. You'll see some footage of her later on. And uh, they're to Opie. So these are these are out of Opie. That's my favorite guy right there, that, that buckskin one. Uh, he's kind of laid back, man, but he is he is the absolute king. He's the he's the ruler of this domain. And uh, something tells me he's going to make quite a bulldog. The two red ones are female. Very outstanding, very outgoing pup. And uh, the two black ones are males. They seem to be uh, larger dogs than, than I would like. However, uh, listen, I'm concerned about their courage, not their size. All right, this is the litter here. Bonita, uh, too handsome. And usually they always try to bite my fingers when I, when I close them back up. But uh, outstanding pups are uh, all ready to go. Uh, these are uh, 750s. I'm going to take these dogs out in just a little bit. Uh, this is a pure boomerang female here, uh, M80. She's outside. This is Kali's pen. And uh, these are two Patrick puppies that are out of uh, Lady Handsome, bred to Anton. You'll see Anton, who looks kind of like that little male there, on some other footage. Uh, these pups are $1,000 apiece. They're pure Patrick. And down in uh, my uh, cellar, uh, here is uh, there are a couple of pups that are uh, pure boomerang. They are just, uh, there are only two of those, but uh, they carry boomerang oh, almost a hundred times. Very, very tight, tight boomerang. Now, uh, That's my baby. <laughs> That's my baby. Heavy, heavy boomer. Uh, these pups will be a thousand apiece when they're ready uh, to go. Now moving on this side over here. Uh, let's see. This is a dog that got into a, a kennel fight. Uh, 
and uh, that hurt pretty bad, so I've got to keep him here and treat him. Uh, this is uh, Honey. She is probably as pure an iron head pistol and a spike combination as exists. You'll see some of her relatives uh, from the early 80s on some ad uh, an old advertisement that uh, I will include in, in uh, your package. Uh, these two guys here are also uh, pure boomerang. Uh, that's little shorty. And the female there uh, is Ragata. Uh, they're not impressive looking puppies. They're just so inbred. Uh, but I'm, I'm real pleased with them. Uh, you'll notice the ear on that little guy, Shorty. Uh, Shorty uh, decided that uh, he wanted to be a bad little bulldog, and um, unfortunately, his mind was bigger than his behind, and uh, he got his feelings hurt. But it doesn't seem to be any of the worse for wear, but he did lose a chunk of that ear, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, I had his feelings hurt pretty bad. Hey, guys. Okay, around the corner here, uh, this is Faya. Faya is a boomerang bitch. She is an intense a bitch. Watch closely for her in later footage. Uh, she is intense and absolutely a destruction uh, machine. Um, she is the mother of Kali and Mr. Blister that you had seen uh, earlier. Hey, baby. Oh, that's daddy. Oh, yeah. That daddy, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, she's a sweet girl. Now, her pups, uh, they're now. Pure Boomerang. If you're serious about boomerang, uh, which is a uh, pistol miss spike. Uh, this is the way to go. These puppies are, I believe, going to be outstanding dogs, uh, and I expect them to to uh, to make quite a name for themselves. So there you go. This is the litter. of uh, the, the bitch's name is Faya. Spanish for ugly. But she's not that bad, though. Huh? Oh, that's a face only a mama could learn. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's my girl. Oh, baby. That's my sweet thing. But, uh, wicked. Insane. She needs to be committed. But read that, will you? Say, uh... But, uh, these... These pups will also be a thousand dollars when they're ready, which we'll do in about four or five weeks. Hey, Johnny Blue Eyes. Yeah, I guess he's coming up on eleven months now. So Anton, Miss Bobby, very nice looking pup. Can it blow? Thank you. 
She's going good. I yeah. just her on the ground. Yeah, she's also keeping a little bit. I thought I read a little bit. A little bit out there. These are dogs up there uh, down in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Champion Sam is over. They're off in the distance there. That's Mariah out of Willie and Willie. Really? That girl, that's uh, Heavy Coco. She's uh, fat looking a little bit. Beautiful pet. 
is uh, Bea. Bea is a little mate, uh, or rather a full sister to Peaches and Levi that's down south. Uh, that she's off of the first litter. She's the mother of uh, Mr. Blister and Kali and a little reader that you just saw. This is Little Taya. That's Big Joey. <laughs> now, we, we plan to kill Curly. Curly's still burning. And uh, just uh, a beautiful warrior in his own right. He loves it. Loves every minute of it. And uh, we're hoping for great things from him. We're going to send him south to uh, bring across some of the all pro bitches uh, that we have. That's the little cheesy doll. Boy, oh, she's jumping up and everything I do. She was bred by the milkman. And uh, had a couple of pups, so we had a nice litter. We're real proud of, uh, of what we got from her. A couple of them down in uh, Florida. Very nice. Yeah. This is Starback, the grand old lady. Rita, her name is. You know, she's now, uh, she's got to be 13, I guess. She's got uh, walks all over her and just living a good life. Old lady. And all of the dogs I showed you before, uh, Pearly and, and those are lying dead on her. The bitch uh, off of Cosmos, he's all for his brother, uh, to his half sister. He was off of bones and a uh, big robot. So uh, this, this bitch here would, would uh, be about uh, three quarters of boomer, roughly, quarter big row. Uh, her name is Jimmy's daughter. She's a uh, little pup off of Jimmy's daughter. A little bit. Uh, to Mike. Mike, right? Yeah, bet to Mike. Beautiful. Beautiful pup. Yeah. Now again, this is, uh, this is off of uh, Goody's daughter, to Mike. You can see from the scar over her eye, they're fighting already. Hurting each other up. They can hardly even move. That's the kind of pups we produce. Uh, or did he, or did he ever say? No, I don't, I don't remember. I know he's a, he's a little mate, brother, sister breeding. He's a, he's off a buckshot. Or near buckshot and near his bag and they're both off a good year. I took a picture of his pastor, which is uh, Al Capone and Scar, the old Eli Jr. Billy Sun. This dog is probably as pure a Billy Sun and Eli Jr. as you'll get. Uh, possibly with the exception of old Clyde down in, uh, in Georgia. Uh, and we're trying to get hooked up so we can get him and Clyde and, and keep that blood going. But uh, he's a... He's a rough customer two times. Well, well, who was that that broke his shoulder? That was the second fight. Uh, that was in Louisiana. Okay, so even having his shoulder broken, uh, he still went on to win. And I thought I remembered that t boss saying something that even his back end was, was, was hurt real bad, and he still he still went on to win. So uh, just uh, one, one fantastic uh, bulldog. Like yeah, somebody be in, in, in for it. All right, son, all right. <laughs> all right, big champion fan. Let's see, 
Okay, honey. When I change the seat, it affected some dogs more than others. Okay, okay. Kind of got drawn down from it. Now, Tracy looks good. She looks great. This is uh, a little bit spread by uh, Ralph. And uh, off of uh, his dog Scatter. And uh, Scatter uh, got Mike Brown Sugar. I got to change the collar. He's getting too much on him. There's his champion, Opie. Say yes. Now, this is uh, Red Ruby, Black Mike. Champion Opie. 
Get back here to do a champion there, Sam. She's a rather big bitch. Uh, looks to be right now, oh, just guesstimating about 50 pounds, 51. As she stands the profile for you, Miss Opie. She's Nigarino Boomerang. And uh, she's the daughter of a dog called uh, Aggie. She's Nigarino Boomerang. The right money for them. All right, this is Eminem. Eminem is a uh, son of banjo off of a daughter, grand champion banjo, incidentally. Out of a double daughter of uh, Gabe. Uh, he's available. Grand Gabe. Yeah, he's grand champion Gabe, back to his daughter. And uh, some Patrick behind that. Uh, he's been tested, he looks pretty good. Has a little problem with, it, with one of his rear legs when he really starts pushing. Uh, so we wouldn't want to sell him, but uh, for a stud dog, somebody could be real good with him. And he'll grab one at the drop of the hat. He's about uh, old 41, 42. If he were a mask dog, he, his weight would have been in the high 30s. Okay, here's another pup. Champion Sam. Say <laughs> honey. Huh? Come on. An older dog got off the chain, no matter where he got wrapped up in his chain, and he just came to that. If that other dog was an older dog, he would have. I'm tested. Waiting to take a look at it. Looks good, though. This is Mickey out of Hollingsworth Bull, owned by uh, G. Bell of uh, Long Island. Uh, waiting for her to come in. Beautiful, beautiful little bit. Hollins West Bull on the top, and uh, Champion Rattler and Chinaman on the bottom. I even remember a spot on there all the time. This is Bay Bay. Bay Bay is uh, a red boy uh, on the top. Some of the hunter red breeding. And uh, keep this rage on the, the bottom. Uh, this is her half brother Butch. The Pulaski Road Butcher, his official name is. On the bottom, he is uh, Chief Otis Honeybunt. Uh, we'll be taking a look at him and her very soon. I tell you, he's a beauty, isn't he? Yeah. He's so fat and stuff. I got him on just that one pup, too. And he just maintains. <laughs> I guess once you got them real good and fat, you put them on something else and they'll pretty much maintain. Right. Now, now he and Bebe were bred uh, by Rick at Pit Stop. We'll be taking a look at him soon. This is Miss Bobby. She is the mother of Johnny Blue Eyes and the little uh, pet I'd shown you earlier in, in the footage with the scar on his head. Funny bitch. She, she comes in heat real strange, but uh, very animated. Lovely dog. And uh, we're going to breed her again. This little bitch here, she, she just grinning. Do that, but just 
this bit here is a heavy boomer and a pure fool. She's always been a rock dog. We should have named her Rocket. But uh, she's, uh, I looked at her pretty good, and, and, and I'm, I'm real, real pleased with what I see. Uh, she's Jet, of the old Preacher Man dog. Heavy original cargo, my, my own stuff, and uh, uh, we brought in uh, Boomer 33 William. Uh, looking real good. But she's just so proud of her accomplishment. Really enjoys uh, a good role, too. Oh, look at the we took a good hard look at her down in Florida. And uh, very satisfied. Uh, she's got a tremendous mouth on her, pretty, pretty fair mouth. And uh, seems, to, seems to carry herself quite well. Um, in fact, she stopped the bitch. And uh, we sent her up here a few pounds. I don't know how many would you say, Jay? About four, three or four pounds. About three or four pounds. I thought it was more than that. Could have been. You know, right? Hey, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is just an airplane. Patrick Hanson, Patrick Bermuda. Yeah, I can see her swelling up again. You know, she was, uh, he was real, man. Oh. Once she got that bitch off at 20 minutes, had a lapse, and she just really had nothing else, you know? Okay. And she screwed up, and that bitch got her again. <laughs> <laughs> this is, what's her name, Jay? Tiny. Tiny. Got a champion raw hide and champion missile. Champion raw hide, champion missile. <laughs> Yeah, this, this, is, this, is, <laughs> this is Inferno, Inferno's uh, Bermuda Anton, but we're going to repeat the breeding on that, and uh, also in that little is Black Mac that uh, I understand from the gentleman in Virginia that uh, he's, a, he's a maniac, and then there's B.I., Bad Intentions, that you saw a little earlier. Inferno. Okay, here's a young pup. Uh, Anton Samantha. Samantha is the sister of the champion, okay. Anton's uh, Bonita. Uh, excuse me, Anton is uh, hot dog, Sheba. Uh, heavy uh, bolio tombstone. There's uh, one he's for sale. They're, they're about uh, 10, 11 months old now. Uh, there's another one over there. And um, Samantha. This is Little Bat. Buck <laughs> is a powerhouse. Young dog coming up on a year old. Uh, ready to be looked at. He's for sale. If you're interested. So these are two pups. This one here is Anton, Sam, and as is this one here. Won't be long. You'll be looking, taking a look at them. Put your beards in early. They will not be cheap. Yeah, athletic bitch. Good. Out on the knees, got good, good. She is out of Sam Elvira. Beautiful, beautiful 
Confirmation on her. Powerful dog. Do a banjo bit. Come here, girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Who is this, Jeff? Sam and Honey. Sam and Honey again. Not ready to be tested. Beautiful bitch. <laughs> Sam Elvira. Strong, powerful young dog. He's a brother to uh, Tommy Boy that's over in the city with me. Yeah, he's a big, fine puppy. Yeah, nothing much, though. Nearly to the sweet. Huh? Put a couple of nails in the top of it. That thing and they look to the sweet. You'll probably rip it off. That's you probably start banging it and ripping it off. Yeah, oh, he'd love that. Yeah, yeah you hang, hang it up for him. That's like a punching bag. A little raw high. Tough customer. Loves the rumble. He's a Levi's brother. <laughs> uh, honey boy. This is Honey boy. Got some bad leg over here. Yeah, this is the sister. Champion Sam. Yeah, he's gorgeous, man. <laughs> you gotta come out rumbling, I'm going to try to <laughs> 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 back in there. I suppose
में He's got some hangers in his head, uh, uh, and uh, although he's now about seven, he still has all of his teeth, and uh, still still can use them pretty good. Got to be careful with him. He's a friendly dog, but you just can't cross him and expect not to pay. Hope he get out for me. This guy is a real nice. A nice young pup, well made, a little rangy, which is nice, but uh, a real, a real powerhouse. Kind of a chain fighter, so I have to be careful with him. Uh, try to break him out of it, but it's hard. He's, he's very determined. This is Tommy Boy. These pups here, uh, Bonita. And, uh, and Opie. They're about four and a half months old. They were turning in the litter. Beautiful pet. See, my battery's getting a little low on this. This litter here is Champion Opie and Peachy, their sister. They are just, uh, real nice. That little reddish one right there, uh, crawled into the pen with these bigger guys over here the other day. And uh, I'll be down if he didn't try to stop some, some mess over there. I was afraid they'd gang up on him and kill him, so I had to get him out of there. But, uh, nice puppies. And uh, you see there's one or two real little ones. They just never really developed. They're right back there. Uh, but, Trying to, trying to hang in there, as you can see. Very pleased with these guys. There are a couple of pups in here that goes right back to some of the uh, new hound bull breeding. And uh, sister to uh, Miss Crystal. So, uh, we're, we're hopeful for great things for men. These guys taking it easy over here. <laughs> Just kind of relaxing. Dead side by Champion Sam. These are uh, Patrick, and uh, that guy right there is uh, uh, from, a, from another little Opie. But uh, these guys are Patrick. They've been banging each other up pretty good, and I've had to separate them, and uh, they, they'll get along for a while, but it won't be long. This 
racism. Men are basically, uh, you know, heavy. Uh, in the the daddy is champion, Opie. The mother is uh, Peaches. Uh, Peaches is three quarters uh, Boomer. Uh, one quarter uh, uh, Boudreau. And uh, she's, she's nuts herself, so. And, you know, Opie. Opie don't seem to be too much of a slouch himself, so. Well, we just hope to be able to keep the peace as long as we can. Uh, I'm just letting them out so I can clean the pins. All right, signing off for now. We have to really keep an eye on these guys. a little shy, but uh, you let him buy another dog and he, he's totally different. Now the litter on the inside of the pen uh, is fired by Champion Sam out of uh, side by Champion Sam uh, out of the daughter of uh, Champion Opie. That's Pat. I mean, that's uh, Jojo. Banjo to uh, Lloyd Bell. But uh, these are the these are the pups, and uh, so far, so good. Uh, one went to Texas, two went to Florida. Uh, one is supposed to go to Canada, and another to Kentucky. Uh, if I decide to uh, to let them go, as you can see, this is the wrecking crew. They're lean, uh, built uh, pups, rather rangy. Um, and the body type is rather hard, uh, as is their mother. Their mother's hard as a rock, although she doesn't uh, get a lot of exercise, nor do a lot of running. But mama's coming out of her shell, 
and uh, so far uh, I'm very pleased with that. I'm going to pause it again while I bring in Mama, and then hopefully uh, Mama and Pups will have a good run. Mama's in there and looks as if she's got to put her foot or paw down because uh, the pups are getting a little rough. But uh, I'm just happy that so far she's doing a magnificent job. Now I hope that they don't get too rough and I've got to go in there and bail them out because you'll probably, probably bite them pretty good. But she seems to be doing the mother thing and uh, giving them a warning without really hurting them. But they nursed on her for quite a long time. As you can see, she enjoys she enjoys running. Her nails are filed down pretty good because she's on uh, cement mostly. Uh, I probably probably have her a bit heavy. I just uh, happen to enjoy seeing a dog with a little flesh on him. Uh, I hate bulldogs that are, look like they're match ready. And uh, they seem to have no defense if something should come up at them as far as the disease is concerned. So I like to keep them in fairly, fairly good shape. And of course a big part of that might be the fact that I enjoy eating myself. Therefore, I want my pups and my dogs to probably look as fat as I do. But that is uh, Patrick's Bonita, sent to me by uh, Pat Patrick and Emily Dennis, out of Tucson, Arizona. And this is Colt. He's a son of Red Ruby, approximately 62, 64 pounds, uh, starting to develop a fairly good attitude on him. Cold, 11 months, uh, I believe, in uh, this month we'll be able to see a little more of him uh, later on. I like him. He's a, he's a fine alert puppy. Streak that just went by. That's taking a little station break over there. Uh, this little guy is uh, Patrick Anton. He is. I'm trying to be polite with this shot here.
so much of the old Sandman dog uh, is off of uh, Little Sugar, who's brown sugar, heavy Sandman, uh, weenie breeding. Uh, he's going to make a, a massive dog. He's right now, he's probably in the neighborhood of about uh, 52, 53 pounds, while his sister, uh, Sugar Cream, is uh, only uh, somewhere around uh, 30, 39. They're about uh, five, about six months old now. Hi, baby. Hi, puppy, puppy, puppy. That's my girl. Oh, listen, who could love a face like that? Oh, look at that, look at that. Now, here he comes to hold the spotlight. Hey, baby, that's a girl. That's my puppy. Okay. winner real slick fair mouth he's the sire of the dog mother trucker who's won one and is open to match now he's also the sire of blue who went to 14 to a draw no turns no out of holes both bitches died uh, we just bred him in a repeat breeding of that mother trucker dog. Beautiful combat dog, and we hope to lay a good, solid foundation with him. He's got a good feel to him. He's strong. He's a powerhouse, an absolute powerhouse. I'm very pleased with him. And I'm hoping that he'll make a good addition to our stud force here. Yeah, he's a, he's a beauty. Now, he likes to grab the bottom of his collar, and in grabbing it, he, he'll do flips to try to get it, which tells me that he's an athlete, and he'll do whatever is necessary to get into holes. All right, this is all pro. Game tested bulldog. Typical of these boomerang dogs. He likes to. He likes to front like he's a. A real killer, but in reality, nothing but a pussycat. Uh, he has been game tested to the max. He's produced several one and two time winners. We're trying to find a champion son. We're trying to get the record on him. There's a son that's supposed to be a three time winner. I'm checking on that while I'm here in Florida right now. This is all pro. Yeah, real strong bulldog. He's a little old now. He's about five years old, but uh, the years have taken a toll on him. But he's still in, in pretty, pretty good condition. And as you can see, there's a whole lot of that. That old boomer uh, right there. When you when you look at him, bro. Look at my boy. This is my boy. This is my boy. Huh? This is my boy. Look at this one. Hey, 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 yeah. All right. This little springboard here is a daughter of Tobacco Road. Uh, she just had a litter of pups from All Pro. They're looking real fine. 
Uh, it's the uh, uh, combination of Bolio uh, Boomerang that I like so well. It ought to make a pretty fair bulldog. And uh, she's young. We bred her real early, uh, quite frankly, before we even took a good look at her. But uh, that's okay. I'm willing to take that chance with the strength of the blood and on the fact that it has worked in the past. I'm coming up here now on Black Mike. Uh, he's a big dog, uh, kind of laid back, but a formidable combat dog who has been game tested. He's a, a real powerhouse. He loves the back end. He can cripple one in the belly and the kidneys. Uh, I hesitated on breeding him for years because I was afraid that we would get just too large a dog. He himself looks to be somewhere in the in the neighborhood, if I can find him in this camera here. I'm, I'm, I'm just kind of new at this, so please bear with me here. As you can see, he he's an affectionate dog. He loves to be to be rubbed and loves just for you to play with him and let him know how much you how much you love him. But rest assured, when it's all said and done, uh, he'll hurt your dog uh, real bad. This is. Uh, Black Mike. Now, Black Mike is sired by champion Iron Mike Tyson. Uh, his dam is a bitch called Red Lady. And he, Iron Mike, is the culmination of uh, my breeding program, which incorporated Sandman, Blackjack, Spook, and Weenie. We still have uh, the Weenie breeding heavy. And this dog shows a great uh, Sandman Blackjack influence. He's producing some very sharp dogs. Uh, I'll have them later on video. Once again. This is all pro. He's Sweet William. Foxy Sweet William. Peaches. Sweet William Foxy, and the bottom side is Bully Son uh, coming through uh, Shavo and Cowboy, but uh, my old and my old Penelope Pit Stop and Ghetto breeding. Right, I expect he looked real good. We we hit him for a couple of minutes, and uh, he handled himself like a real trooper. Very pleased, very impressed with uh, with the with the mouth that he's showing. Uh, very impressed with uh, his style. Uh, feel happy with her. We're hoping that uh, she'll she'll be the kind of dog that we can use in our program. Uh, she's she's actually a black and white with tan markings. Seems to be a friendly dog. Uh, tested one time. Looked fairly decent. And. Uh, yeah, that's that's Terry talking to her. She's wagging her tail. She's a very outgoing puppy. And uh, we, we'll probably go with an outcross on her because she's so heavily uh, inbred on Dirty Mary. So she's the consummate bully son uh, Bolio, but we're going to have to go a different way with her to strengthen uh, the, the bolio aspect on her. And once again, that's uh, brute force right there. Uh, love him. He, he handled himself like a pro. You don't have to ask. Very pleased with that. Way over in the distance is a little bitch that is uh, Bad Whiskey's sister, a bitch called Dirty 
red. We're going to be breeding Dirty Red in just a, a little while. Dirty Red is the niece of the, the Fritz dog. We might put her to him. Once again, this is Fritz. Beautiful dog. I tell you, he is rock hard. He's missing a cutter, and there are a couple that are flat, but uh, he, he can still pinch you pretty good. He's known throughout this, this area as a seasoned combat dog. He's won nine off the chain rolls. He's won two in the pit that are documented. Good old Fritz. These are some pups that we have. They're sired by Bad Whiskey. I'll show you Bad Whiskey in a minute. Bad Whiskey is a nephew to Fritz and a sister to the bitch, Dirty Red. These are pups sired by All Pro. The ones with the white faces are out of bad whiskey and Jughead, a Otis Bread dog. They seem to be some exceptionally nice pups. I really like them. That one that we're looking at now seems to resemble the old boomer stuff more than ever. The other one is trying to hog the camera now, the beautiful black pup. This little dog here has got to be a chihuahua. She can't weigh a half a pound, but she thinks she's the baddest thing in there. I'm very happy with, with, with the litter. She probably won't be any more than about uh, 20 pounds. But uh, it's just fortunate that she even lives. But don't misunderstand me. Now, she'll get on one in a skinny minute and try to hurt his feelings. I'm walking through here now. And uh, as I was walking through with these dogs, I'm, I'm looking at some spiders that are just absolutely huge. I don't know if I can zero in on one or or if this will come fairly clear. But uh, these suckers here, look like they can grab a man and throw him down. Hell, I might take one and try to match that sucker. But they're sure big enough. And there's several of them around. One of the trappings of living in Florida. Now this dog, once again, me and on this camera, this dog is this is bad whiskey. Bad whiskey, favorite pastime is jumping up tearing the orange tree apart complete with oranges he's a rangy dog seems to be very athletic and uh, that's the one I was telling you that is a nephew to bad uh, excuse me to uh, Fritz very happy with him yeah, we tested him out. Extremely hard mouth on him. It's a little difficult to tell when you look at a dog just what kind of mouth he'll have. And you wouldn't think that he'd have very much of a mouth. But uh, he, he, can, he can put a bite on one. Uh, 
this little bitch is Red Dog Sister, Sister Red. Fine bitch, hard mouth on her, serious attitude. Yeah, I'm sorry, this is Little Sugar, excuse me. This is Little Sugar. She's off of Black Mike and Brown Sugar. She is the sire of the two pups that I have up in New York City. One male at uh, five months old is now 51 pounds. I don't know how big he'll end up being, but uh, he may take after old Black Mike after all. But this is Brown Sugar, uh, one formidable bitch uh, with, a, with a pretty decent mouth on her. I like her. I'm moving over now through the jungle, as you can see, with the palmettos, complete with the palmettos and oak trees and orange trees and God only knows what else. But now, this is, uh, this bitch is Black Mamba. She is Iron Mike uh, Tyson's daughter. She's Black Mike's sister. She has produced some extremely uh, uh, tough dogs. We're very pleased with everything we've gotten from her. And uh, we, we're going to be breeding her again real soon. Hopefully, uh, we'll, we'll put her across uh, Fritz or All Pro. <laughs> Moving now over to... Uh, hey, sugar. This bitch, his name is Sophie. Sophie is Fritz's littermate sister, and uh, she she had an accident. She tried to jump out of a two-story building at a dog, and uh, she fractured a, a hip. So uh, the only time she was ever really looked at was uh, quite a long time ago. But uh, she is the mother. Um, of several excellent uh, bulldogs, including Bad Whiskey. Um, we're going to, to be breeding her game. Um, in fact, she is bred now to All Pro. That should be the consummate uh, Bolio, Bully Sun Eli, uh, Boomer combination. Looking forward to some fantastic pups from that. This is the pit. Several excellent dogs in here. This black one that's jumping up like she's crazy is a repeat breeding on brute force. She's off of uh, uh, Black Mike. Now, the little black dog that looks like a little rat back there, uh, if I can get her uh, focusing on her a bit. She, she's kind of nuts. In, 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 in fact, she's got a hickey on her head uh, from fighting. And uh, when, she, when she was released, she ran into the corner at the dog and hit her head. And she's got a big bump on there. So, uh, but she, she, she's serious about what she's doing. Likes to get underneath and hurt one. This little bitch here is her sister and uh, hope we've got high hopes for them they're off of dirty red these other dogs are basically off of a dog called playboy which is a jeep uh, bred dog that we have for sale